I'm here to talk about this book, Black Radishes, and it is a wonderful book, but I'm going to complain about it. And I don't usually complain when I'm book talking, but first of all, it's called Black Radishes. Now, I don't know, a wood vegetable is not the most exciting thing, so they don't even show a picture of a black radish on the cover. So what I want you to know is a black radish looks like a big black carrot and it's white on the inside and it does not taste like a carrot but why name the book black radishes well you'll have to read it to find out because black radishes you will find out are very important for fighting a war now another thing this cover does which is a little sneaky i think is it looks nice and quiet the boys riding a bike you don't know that this is taking place during World War II and it's in France in the countryside and at this point France has been divided into two separate sections. There's the free zone and there's the occupied zone. The occupied zone is occupied by the German army. The free zone is kind of free. It's not really free but it's not as dangerous. And this boy you see here, Gustav, he is a Jewish boy from Paris, and he's been sent to the countryside to be safe, or at least that's what his parents are hoping. Now, one thing this cover does show you way in the corner here is you will see a castle. Now, castles are cool. Um, this castle is especially cool because it is a huge place, and it goes over a river that divides the free France from the occupied France. And that is also a very special weapon used in this book to help fight during World War II. And Gustav, of course, the center of the story, gets involved with black radishes. He has to deal with this castle, and he learns that people make all sorts of choices in a war situation. And they learn to choose whether they're going to fight with the good side or the power that is trying to um, kill many people. So it is a very exciting story, even though it's called Black Radishes, and even though the cover looks nice and calm. So give it a try.